Hello everyone. Welcome to Shruti's Pharma World. Today I am going to talk to you about drum filter. Drum filter is a filtration equipment and this equipment is working based on surface filtration. Before enter into the topic, I will explain all the important parts that is present in a drum filter. The drum filter consists of a metallic cylinder which is mounted horizontally. Okay? Our drum filter consists of a metallic cylinder which is mounted horizontally. And this drum filter has a curved surface. Here you can see our drum filter has a curved surface. And this surface is made up of using perforated plate. Otherwise we can say our curved surface has a number of perforations on their surface. And this perforated plate provides support to our filter cloth. Filter cloth is placed on this perforated plate. This drum filter is radially partitioned and the annular space of this drum filter is divided into separate compartments like this. Here you can see different compartments. Annular space of this drum filter is divided into separate compartments. Each of this compartment is connected by an internal pipe into the center of the drum via a rotating valve. Actually, that rotating valve is not visible here, but it is there. And that rotating valve connect the compartment to the center of the drum via an internal pipe. So, these are the important parts which is present in a drum filter. And here you can see different zones or different regions like pickup zone, drainage zone, washing zone, drying zone and cake removal zone. The division of this regions or zones is based on the working of a drum filter. In this presentation, we are going to discuss about the principal construction working advantages and disadvantages of this drum filter. So students welcome back to Shruti Swama world and now we are going to discuss about the principle of this drum filter. Here you can see our drum filter. This is our drum filter and here you can see a slurry reservoir. Now our drum filter is just dipped in the slurry reservoir. Actually the slurry reservoir containing slurry and now you can see our drum filter is just dipped in the slurry reservoir okay now we are going to switch on the drum filter when we are switching on the drum filter at that time vacuum starts to operate so the surface of our drum filter that pick up some amount of slurry from the slurry reservoir on their surface then liquid from the slurry enter through the internal pipe and then it reaches the collecting tank which is present in the center of this drum filter. Okay. All this process is carried out under vacuum. The, the surface of this drum pick up some amount of slurry on their surface. Then uh, liquid from the slurry that is filtering through this curved surface. Actually our curved surface has a number of perforations and above that perforated plate filter cloth is placed. So, through sieve-like mechanism, filtration will be occur. The slurry is filtered through sieve-like mechanism on this rotating drum surface under the conditions of vacuum. Then, liquid from the slurry that enter the internal pipe. And it travels through the internal pipe and it reaches the collecting tank which is present in the center of the drum filter. Like this, filtration will be occur. In addition to this filtration operation, compression, drying, removing the filter cake, all these processes are possible using this drum filter. Now move on to the construction part of our drum filter. As we know, drum filter consists of a metallic cylinder and which is mounted horizontally. And this metallic cylinder is having 3 meter diameter, 3.5 meter length and 20 meter square area these are the dimensions you should remember every time and this drum has a curved surface 
and it is having perforations on their surface. Here you can see the curved surface of our drum filter and the curved surface of this drum filter is made up of perforated plate. Above this perforated plate, our filter cloth is placed and this perforated plate provides support to our filter cloth. This drum is radially partitioned and the annular space of this drum is divided into several compartments. Each of this compartment is connected to an internal pipe via rotating valve into the center of the drum. Here you can see a single compartment is present here and this compartment is connected by an internal pipe into the center of the drum through a rotating valve. These are the important points regarding the construction part of our drum filter. Now move on to the working of drum filter. As we know drum filter is working based on surface filtration. Surface filtration is just like a sieve like mechanism. Here filtration occurs through this curved surface. Because this curved surface has a number of perforations on their surface. Above this curved surface, our filter cloth is placed. So, filtering the slurry through a sieve-like mechanism on this rotating drum surface under the conditions of vacuum. That is the basic principle involved in drum filter. Now, let's see the working procedure in detail. Here, you can see our uh, drum filter is dipped in a slurry reservoir. As it dips in the slurry reservoir, vacuum is applied in this segment then due to this vacuum drum surface pick up some amount of slurry on their surface and with the help of this vacuum liquid from the slurry passes through the internal pipe and then it reaches the collecting tank which is present in the center of the drum okay it is very simple you listen here first of all our drum filter is dipped in a slurry reservoir which is containing slurry. When we are switch on the drum filter, at that time vacuum starts to operate. Because of this vacuum, the surface of the drum filter pick up some amount of slurry on their surface. Now slurry adhered on the surface of the drum filter and the slurry containing liquid. That liquid from the slurry is filtered through the curved surface because the curved surface containing filter cloth so through that filter cloth filtration operation will be carried out so liquid from the slurry passes through the filter cloth and then it reaches the compartment and this compartment is connected to an internal pipe so the liquid that is traveled through this internal pipe and it reaches the collecting tank which is present in the center of the drum okay this is very simple procedure now the drum leaves the pickup zone and it enter the drainage zone the drum leave the pickup zone and it enter the drainage zone in the drainage zone special K compression rollers are there. Listen, in the drainage zone, special K compression rollers are present. With the help of this K compression rollers, that cake will be compressed. That solid cake will be compressed and more and more amount of water is removed in the same way. Through the filter cloth, filtration will be occur. Like that sieve-like mechanism, the liquid from the slurry or the liquid from the solid cake which is removed through that internal pipe into that collecting tank. In the drainage zone, excess amount of uh, water is removed with the help of this cake compression rollers. And liquid from the solid cake travel through the internal pipe and it reaches the collecting tank which is present in the center of the drum. Then the drum leaves the drainage zone and it enter the washing zone. So the next stage is washing zone. In washing zone, water washing will be occur. Water washing of the cake will be occur in this region. Water sprayed on the cake. A separate vacuum system is applied here. That is another important point you should remember. 
okay in washing zone a separate vacuum system is supplied to suck the wash liquid and this wash liquid is collected into a separate collecting tank which is also present in the center of the drum filter okay in washing zone a separate vacuum system is used for the removal of washed water and this washed water is collected through the internal pipe into a separate collecting tank after washing the filter cake the drum enter the drying zone where hot air is blown on the cake so our cake will become dried and this dried cake enter the cake removal zone now the drum filter leave the drying zone and it enter the cake removal zone where we can remove our cake using a scraper blade or a scraper knife and all this processes are completed in one revolution per minute okay actually our drum filter is rotating at a speed less than 1 revolution per minute so you listen all this processes are completed in 1 revolution per minute now the drum is ready to receive a fresh lot of slurry so this is a working procedure that is involved in a drum filter now let's see what are the important uses of this drum filter drum filter is used for continuous operation without hindering the operation we can remove cake uh, using this drum filter so it is mainly used for continuous operations and we can process slurry containing high amount of solids using this filtration equipment slurry containing high proportion of solids up to 15 to 30 percentage of solids we can easily filter using this drum filter it is used for preparing penicillin uh, so these are few important uses of our drum filter move on to the advantages cake is removed simultaneously during operation that is already we have discussed without disturbing the filtration operation we can remove the cake using a scraper knife or a scraper blade uh, so we can use drum filter as a continuous filtration equipment it is it is one of the important advantage of our drum filter and we can filter high concentrated slurries using this equipment labor cost is low and it provides large surface area speed of rotation can be varied and thickness can be controlled so these are the important advantages of our drum filter move on to the disadvantages it is an expensive equipment okay and this drum filter is having complex functioning it is very expensive because it require a lot of other accessories like vacuum pump vacuum receivers and traps so this is one of the most expensive equipment with complex functioning it contain moving parts so wear and tear may occur so these are the important disadvantages of our drum filter in this presentation we have discussed the principle construction working advantages and disadvantages of drum dryer hope you all understand if you like this kind of videos please do subscribe my channel and hit the bell button too then only you will get notification from me thank you for watching